Gary, remember me? I'm the guy that actually is involved with my children, and actually I like to coach the sports that they're in. Oh, no, you're, you, the, you're, the, you're the, the kid that goes in, in the locker room and looks at the little boys. Are you, are you That's the one that comes in on Monday Shut up, John. and brags about their Shut kid? Shut up, John. You know what? Yeah, you're the guy that coaches your little kid. You're the guy that coaches your kid because you have to live through your son, and you have to go out there, and you have to say, I'm the coach. I won the trophy. I'm a Belichick clone. Shut up. Let me, hey, hey butthead, let me talk. Oh, that's, that really hurts, John. I got John. the button, John, so Ooh, take yeah, you're the one that you're the one that brings the orange slices, John. Anyway, I do it because dips like you don't volunteer. There's, What's interesting what? is, you know, Tangway, we always say, can take anything. We dump on him all right. the time. Right. But when it's, when it's the truth, that's when, that's when oh. I know I get worked up. Oh. And I'm serious about this. I lo- you know I love you, and uh, I really love Randy Tangway. And the kids, are, the kids are great, but there's a reason why you ship them off, gone all summer. You have a nanny. You are a barely, uh, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, present. Yeah, that's good, Ken. Barely present. Barely present parent. You're you, not well, there okay. much. Yeah, you, you know what, Kirk? Yeah, you're right. You win. I'm just saying, why are you getting defensive no, about it? No, I'm not getting I'm, defensive I, about I, it. I think you're you know, a wonderful father, but your idea that you shouldn't, you don't coach your kids because that's not healthy. Oh, it's, to, it's not healthy to coach your kids. That's called a juicy rationalization. No, no, uh, no, 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 Gary. no. Yes, it's it not, is. No, it's, yes, you, it is. you should not so, coach your okay, kid. Okay, let's talk about the, your son who plays lacrosse. Yes, he you does. Bra- you brag about him on Monday all the time, and he I scored do. a goal. The coaches, they're all like high school kids? No, the coaches actually, they coach for Laxachusetts. Okay, they're bad then because their sons are on the team, right? Uh, I, I don't think about? they should coach their own kids, but I like it because yeah, who should you coach, don't who have should coach, to coach the team? Uh, well, what we did in Sudbury is for the town lacrosse team, we brought back a player who had been on a championship team, just got out of college, and now he was working in Boston. He didn't have any children, but he was part of the program, and he coached the team. And, so and it was no, great. No fathers are involved. No fathers are involved. Okay, you think that can happen for you. every team? No, but I think you could strive for it. These guys pay him. I mean, it's, did you pay him? I'm sure they did. Okay, you thinking like some towns where it's not named Sudbury, you can do that? Well, I mean, I you know not. maybe, you maybe not, them. but you always pay a fee. I mean, to pay, play on any team. I just believe that your child, male or female, will thrive better on a team if the parent is not coaching. How would you even know? You didn't spend right. time with your kids. No, I, yeah, oh yeah, I never spend time with my kids. That's it, girl. How many times yeah. did you see your daughter this summer when she was away at camp in Maine? Seven weeks. Uh, we start three and a half weeks in. Well, good for, thing you for, weren't for an there. afternoon, right? You, you, good thing you weren't there. That would have been unhealthy. You don't oh, yeah. want to spend so much time yeah, with right. your. See, that's where you guys are just complete n- narrow-minded asses. You're I mean, li- you're you're, li- a, you're you're a lousy no, parent. It's no, not a big deal. No, you're okay. a good guy. You're a lousy parent. You, you don't understand what summer camp can do for a kid. Unlike Kirk, oh. who can't take his eyes off his kid. Oh, I, Every minute he's always looking over his shoulder. <laughs> that's true. I mean, I, he, well, you want to any... talk about a helicopter <laughs> parent? I, I, I mean, Harry and Kate, they're not gonna they're not gonna know what to do when they leave the nest. The kid goes. You know what the problem is when the kid goes to camp for ten weeks? All he does is seven hang, weeks. All he does is hang out with Jewish kids, right? They don't meet well, any they're Christians. All, they're all Jewish. There's no Gentiles. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh, so, is that an anti-Semitic remark? You yes. got a problem with the yes. Jews? No, Jerry. Yes, we do. There you go. I've never met. He's a racist and he's anti-Semitic. I've never met. Yeah, when you when you went to see your kid at camp, did you see any naked boys? Because I know you're oh, into that. Oh, it's a so no. you're into that. Most, see, I have evidence of his of his of racial and, mo- and, and, okay. and Jewish the bias. Mo- I, the most, the, you know, I've never Jewish, touched a child. The most Jewish person I know is Tangway. Right. Oh, he is, he is. I, it's so Let's good being to, Jewish, uh, though. Paul, it's great. I Paul, love it. Paul in Watertown. Go ahead, Paul. Hey, guys. First time I uh, call a long, long time listener. Callahan, you and I went to high school together. Jeez, you um, sound old. Oh, I am old. And uh, I thought you were a schmuck then, and it's good to see some things never change. But I can't believe I'm actually calling to support Tangway's position. Go ahead. I played, I played hockey. I played baseball growing up as a kid. My father actively coached, but he would not coach a team on which I was a, a member. Um, I think it was the right decision. I think, Gary, you're doing the right thing. And I think you should be here five days a week, brother. You well, think, thanks, you think Gary doesn't coach because he thinks if he did, it would be unhealthy for his child? Yeah. I think it sets up an awkward position with your child. It's a no-win situation. He's absolutely That's, right. Y- your, father, your father was a bad parent who didn't want to spend time with you, Paul. I know that. And he rationalized, just like Gary. He doesn't want to put in the time it takes to coach. Don't he call left the guy's it. father a bad no, parent. He, he Jerry, it. you didn't listen to what Paul is saying. He you left f- it to somebody else because he didn't want to put in the time. And then his rationalization was, oh, my kid's on the team. I don't but, want to but, coach. But, but to Paul's point. No. And Paul, so who coached, Paul? Well, let Paul who be coached? clear. You're not listening to Paul. So who the coached him? The realization was that uh, maybe other other adult authority figures had things to teach me, and uh, he took an active participation. He coached little league. He coached ice hockey. He just he coached other kids. Coach his own son. So yeah. who coached you? 
Um, well, other kids, name, other kids' fathers, names. other other names. players' fathers. fathers. Absolutely, right? Absolutely. So Paul you think Henderson. that was a, that was Rusty a bad Cloud. idea? What a, a Rusty Cloud did. Okay. Rusty well, Cloud. no, I mean, but but to the Paul's idea point, that no team should, uh, no coach should be coaching a team with well, his kids. It's not. It's not realistic. Well, and, and logistically, it's Kirk's stupid. right. It's hard to do, but it's not stupid. It is very it, stupid. no. Well, one of the things we've done in Lincoln Sudbury with lacrosse is that you don't oh, coach God. your own kid. Shut up, please. Wait, no, no, you two, you shut up, Gary. No, what Gary, happens is, is, that, is that the real world? Yeah, it is the real world. If you have five teams, say you have five lacrosse teams. Yeah. If you have a parent that wants to coach, he coaches another team. He doesn't coach his own son, which is. Totally impractical. No, so then, it is then not. Then you have to drive your kid to practices so and what? games you and miss, go separately. You miss to your, your kids' games. games, then? Yes, you would have to. It depends. Well, some you would. Yeah, he's well, not telling the truth. That's not true. Well, who wants yeah, to miss their would, kids' games? Some, some would. Some would do that. Some would say I'm coaching, and that, yeah. Well, why would you do, do that? that? Let's talk to Paul. Well, and then you wouldn't him. coach. Paul, go ahead. Listen, I, I just want to defend Gary a little bit. Go ahead. I think he'd make. I, I think Gary would make an excellent coach. It just has to be the right fit. Like maybe for someone like Joe Paterno. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. Or, 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 or any Catholic boys team. Any Catholic boys team. Um, he'd be great, you know. And outside of him, being, <laughs> but you know, outside of him being a predator, uh, you gotta ask yourself: Do you really want the revolting blob that is Gary no, Stangway teaching no, your kid no, any no, athletics? No. He can't do anything anyway. He's a terrible athlete. You couldn't do it. <laughs> you play like crossover, Gar. I did not. No. no I mean, I'm that is just so. No, I'm not. I'm, Gary, so Gary, this, this, this is ridiculous. Gary, Gary, I mean, first somebody, of all, it's, you get, it's, the, it's a legitimate medical illness. You're attracted to younger kids. It's Will you a, guys stop it's that? Not, it's not yeah, a choice. I mean, that isn't even funny. For that. I mean, There's that, places you that can isn't go. even funny. You, you, you have no, you know what? That, you know what? That <laughs> isn't even, you're joking about pedophilia. It's not even funny right, because right. you no. don't have a rebuttal for what I'm saying. So you go to something what do you like say that, about which me? is the lowest common what denominator. What do you say about me? See, I think you're you, insane, which I, is true. I don't deny that. I yeah, think, I know, I understand I that, but I'm not a. You, you joke about pedophilia. I, I th- you have nothing to say to me. You have nothing to fire back at me. So I you think, go, oh, you're a pedophile. Oh, like, well, that's. I think that's, you're very that's, honest. That's, that's creative. I think you're a very honest guy, Gary. In this case, you're not being honest. I think you're, I'm being very honest. The reason you don't coach is because it takes a lot of time and effort to coach, and you don't want to put. You can't the do time it, Gary. That is not true, Gary. Gary, my son has asked me to coach basketball a number of times. And I won't do it because I think because he's going to be a better player without me. No, he told me. Attractive First of all, it's not about making boys. him a better player. It's about enjoying the experience. I, I enjoy the experience with him. Gary told me. Uh, that- by the way, I'm getting emails from management because I said I said something bad about Ordway. I apologize. We corrected you. Ordway a, is because you're rolling. a dick. That was a dick thing um, to say. Man, look wish. at the length of this email. And, and, I'm and, never going to be on this and station And Van Tangway again. asked him, he said, would you be uh, the coach of the team? And Gary said, is that cute point guard still there? Van said, no, he's in high school now. <laughs> Whatever. And Gary said, no, I'm done. And we're done. He said... <laughs> I have Gary horses said, around could you, with could you kids. Wear the, the shorts like the well, you guys cut it out. I mean, really, shorts. this is ridiculous. Coach, Coach Tegway has a pu- <laughs> I mean, Coach Tegway has a puberty check. <laughs> I mean, this Coach is ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, you're joking about pedophilia. Cup check. Cup this check. is not funny. I have That's all you guys have. That's I, all I you have, have hugged them and I've, I have touched their leg. I mean, to stop this, Kent. This is not funny. I mean, what are you doing here? I mean, this is not funny. <laughs> Yes, I mean, that's all you have to right fire here. back at me is about touching little boys? <laughs> I mean, this is not funny. <laughs> I mean, I called Jerry a racist because you know what? The shoe fits. You're oh insane God. because you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. I mean, he's anti-Semitic. He you're just right. makes fun yeah. of my kid's Jewish camp. And you guys are you're joking right. about I'm, pedophilia. Right. I apologize. Oh, it's not God. funny. It's not that funny doesn't mean anything. It's, I am too, and I married a Jewish girl. This is the first time I feel like you're lying. That's what you were doing. Uh, you're lying to yourself. The reason you don't coach your kid is because you're too freaking lazy. No, it takes Jerry, time and not, effort and the energy. The reason I don't, I and, could and coach. And you have to know how to coach. I know how to. Don't. I, I, and you sit on the sideline like so many lazy parents and say, let someone else do it. That's what you're doing. No, what I do. do oh, really, Jerry? Yes, that's no, exactly what, I what do. you're doing. When you what I do. Me, well, when you told me that Macaulay Culkin hit the wall in Home Alone 2, what did that mean when you said that? Did you mean like physically? You said he hit what the wall, right? What are you talking right? about? You were no longer attracted to him. Oh, right? sure. <laughs> sure. I mean, this is, I mean really, I'm that. serious. Let's this talk is to not Andrew. funny. Andrew you're right. you're, 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 you're legitimately just, upset? Uh, there, there's the door. This... Do what you did last time. Leave. <laughs> right. Go ahead, Andrew. Good. Get out of here. He just broke his headphones. Good. Go. Be a baby and leave. Is he serious? If you can't take yeah. it, leave. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. He just smashed he just his smashed headphones. His head. We give some new ones. Yeah, you give me yours. I'm not giving mine. Oh, God. We had a... <laughs> Take a picture. Chase him out to the Get garage. Him. Grab him. Grab him. 
Is he serious or is he pretending? I mean, does he really think we're being serious? Is he that dumb? He thinks we're being serious? Uh, yeah, he, a guy can call me a racist. And I'm oh, he supposed can to just say I'm insane. Say and, you're sick in right. the head. Like, so, so he said, by the way, he has said that I'm going to wind up in, we can get the sound, I'm going to wind up in Lowell with a, a needle in my arm because of my That's drug true. addiction. That's okay. But we can't make fun of his, make fun of him when we know he's not a pedi- we, He's not. I don't think he is. Uh, he might it's be. It's a reason why he might be getting so upset about it. Who knows? That's true. Maybe we're hitting home. It's a lot of truth sometimes.